Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for October 7th of 2024 is titled The Long Tales of Comet Chuchinshan Atlas. So what do we see here? Well, this is the comet known as Chu Chinshan Atlas and has recently been discovered this past year and also recently then even more recently passed closest to the sun and passed passing closest to the earth very shortly. And what that means is that it is going to be a comet that is prominent in the sky. So it has brightened as much as people hoped and it actually is visible to the unaided eye right now. The only problem is right now it's also too close to the sun to be visible. So while if you can look in the right direction, the problem is you're going to have the sun in almost that same direction. Now over the coming weeks, it will move away from that at the sun and will be visible and is also moving more northerly in the sky. So it will actually be more visible over the coming weeks and you'll be able to see it in the sky after sunset. So if you look into the west after sunset, you would be able to see this comet, not immediately, but over the next couple of weeks, it should move farther and farther away from our sun. Now the comet itself is just a ball of icy material. So it is ice and dust material. And when it comes closest to the sun, it becomes vaporized and pushes that material back. So the sun vaporizes material off the head of the comet, which is only something a few kilometers in size. And when it does that, the solar wind and energy from the sun pushes that back in the great tails that we see. So we can see the distinct tails here, including the very long dust tail, the bright white here stretching back and kind of curved slightly toward the right. And then going straight back from the sun, but much fainter, but above that and to the left a little bit is the ion tail. Now comets will generally have two tails. The ion tail is smaller particles, individual atoms and ions that are pushed straight back from the sun. The dust tail, on the other hand, lags a little bit behind the comet in its orbit. These are slightly heavier particles, more molecules, and things that are slightly heavier and will lag behind as the comet moves. So you can see that very slight curvature to it caused by the motion of the comet. Now those will hopefully continue to stay as impressively bright as they are now and will be able to be seen over the coming weeks. Now this picture that we're looking at was actually taken a little bit earlier. That was when the comet was in the morning sky and it is now transitioning into evening. So that means it's going to be very easy to see after sunset over the coming weeks. So a chance to see a very prominent comet coming up. Just don't look for it quite yet as right now it's really close to the sun and the brightness of the sun will of course overwhelm that and the comet will have set even as the sun gets farther below the horizon. So that was our picture of the day for October 7th of 2024. It was titled The Long Tales of Comet Chuchinshan Atlas. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be Circular Sunspot. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.